Here we are at the Hoy Show, I'm with good friend John Shamuka. Yeah, happy to be here, Hoy. Good mate, Jesse Adam. Me too, good to be here. Mate, right, we're doing a collab with Garage Entertainment. We're gonna check out some unbelievable DVDs, a full variety of their collage, so let's check it out. Let's do this, boys. Let's go for yeah. it. The Art of Flight, Travis Rice's movie, it's mental. He had uh, massive expectations after his first movie. That's it, that's all. And to back it up with The Art of Flight is just amazing. Massive budget film, goes to the most outlandish places in the world to snowboard with some of the best snowboarders in the world. Mate, it's just an amazing film you've got to go see. It. What do you reckon, Shmoo? Oh, I reckon it's the holy grail of snowboarding DVDs or, or uh, sport action sports DVDs, really. Um, like you said, there's a lot of money thrown at this movie and it, a lot of expectation on Travis to deliver again after that's it, that's all. Um, you know, and he, and he delivered. I watched this movie for the first time and was absolutely blown away by uh, this, the cinematography with the red and the phantom cameras, uh, the athletes themselves, and just the sheer freakiness of the positions they put themselves in, in places uh, around the world and, and on this planet that I wouldn't even think about going, but they think that way, and that's what makes them who they are. So the Art of Flight to me, again, is the holy grail of, of action sports DVDs. It's a must have. It, it, it covers all the age groups, and it covers all the diverse sort of aspects you want to see in a movie. Wow, fear, danger, incredible uh, snowboarding, and just really good vision. Yeah, for sure. How could you not love this film? I mean, the, the combination of Kurt Morgan and Travis Rice have delivered again. Um, and bigger and better is exactly what they had to do. They've nailed it, and like you guys are saying, they're just they're going to the to the extreme and um, you know pushing the limits of snowboarding and they're pushing the limits of um, of cinematography as well. I think they've done an amazing job with how they filmed this from the choppers and just how dangerous and stuff it can be. Not even when they're doing the runs, but even just getting to the spots and, and mm, getting where yeah. they're at. I mean, we look at certain um, uh, sections of the movie like Alaska, um, Chile was 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 really gnarly. Well, the guy didn't even want to go. He didn't want to go. Crazy. Why would you want to go? It's exactly. Ridiculous. Patagonia was ridiculous. They basically didn't even get to ride there because, you know, it was too Flew back out. There's yeah. too, you know, too many variables that weren't, you know, in their control and they, and they couldn't do it, but they, they still went. And that's what the point that you touched on, that no matter who's saying you can't do this, you can't do that, they're going to go and they're going to try and pick a line and do it. I mean, yeah, that's what sets them apart from the rest of the snowboarders in the world is that they have a vision. They see what other riders don't. And I think that's what their sponsors also see is that that vision can be accomplished uh, with guys that have the talent that, that Travis Rice and his buddies do. And I think they delivered in the art of flight. I think that, uh, um, you know, there are certain times where they put their lives on the line to showcase that vision. And to me, it scared the living crap out of me yeah. watching it. I was watching this film and like I love snowboarding and I've done it. But not in that extreme. It, it's it's the extreme of ex all extremes. That's Travis, mate. He's the visionary out of the lot there. He He's is. the one that's going, let's go do it, boys. And all these mates going, well, all right, I'll come with you. If you're going to do it, I'm going to do it with you. They, uh, just the variety of snowboarding he does. He's not just doing tricks in a park or hit mate, building jumps. He's going to big mountains and going, I'm going to ride that mountain. Doing lines that no one else is doing and, and bringing his mates. And they all go, if you're coming, I'm, I'm, I'm backing out, mate. Travis is a freak. Yeah, and, and all his, all his uh, snowboarding b buddies say that. You know, they just, they, they're along for the ride. They're along for this incredible ride. You know, Brain Farm, um, you know, obviously produced this, this whole film. And I think I'm excited. I was excited to see this film. I had never seen it before, and I was just on the edge of my seat the entire time. Um, but I'm really excited to see what the follow-on is because how, how, where do you go from there? Where do you go? 
Well, I think that's what we all thought. After that's it, that's all. Like, how do you how do you build from that? And and they've definitely done it, like we said. But now you're saying, how do they go from here? Like, do they make it even more dangerous, or is that too far? Like, where does the line? You know, where's it drawn in the snow? I think that's the attraction. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I, know, I, I like that. that. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's the attraction, though. Is those guys know no boundaries? They 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 don't take no. It's not even in their vocabulary. I'm sure Travis is already thinking as we're talking about this art of flat here. What am I doing next? He might even know. And I'm excited to see that in production. But right now, it's all about the art of flight, boys. I really enjoyed it. I went. So I was with Travis on the premieres throughout Australia. And name dropping. That's why do you do oh, that? Well, I, I like Dude, the why guy. Why do you do name dropping? I, mean, I got asked to do it. Buddy so Trav, I yeah, yeah, Travis. Yeah, 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 this is my buddy Jesse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, oh, I just got asked to do it, so I was, I was stoked to do it. And just the way he holds himself to through interviews, and he's got to do it every. You know, do, mm. he was doing five or six interviews, ten interviews a day, but. Just how stoked he was and how people saying what we're saying, oh, I can't believe you're doing that stuff. He's like, yeah, that's just part of what I do. And he was so well, like articulate and so well mannered and just did it all, mate. He was just amazing yep. human. To... Where do we get it? Where how do we, we get see it? it? What do you mean? It's right here. No, you go to garageentertainment.com.au, Art of Flight, one of the best movies ever. Without a doubt. So there you have it. We just checked out three unbelievable DVDs, movies, videos, downloads from garageentertainment.com.au. Mate, they're amazing. Three completely different movies. Yeah, I mean, you go as far back as 1981 where we got the Storm Riders here, uh, which was one of my favorites, of course. It's a timeless classic. Um, some great characters. Uh, the real first feature film uh, for surfing in terms of segments of individuals, uh, cinematography, is amazing still. I can watch this one over and over again. Um, Dick Hool, Jack McCoy, and of course uh, David Laurie, uh, the cinematographers behind this, this timeless classic. It's a must see for all ages. I, I really enjoyed it, boys, and the soundtrack is amazing. You can't know, beat it. Uh, can't you, you can't beat it. You know, The Doors, Men at Work, uh, The Australian Crawl. I mean, these days you spend thousands upon hundreds of thousands to get I've done The Australian Crawl. Uh, yeah, about. I've done it too with you a few times in the jungles of G-Land, <laughs> uh, just to, to name a few. But uh, this, this also does feature uh, G-Land uh, in all its glory and some of the best surfers in the world, of course. Your dad's good mate, Mark Richards, uh, Rabbit Bartholomew, and the Kong, Kong's Island. Must see, garageentertainment.com.au, 1981 classic Storm Riders. Go get it. Yeah, definitely a must see, much like Nitro Circus, a little bit more uh, modern. Yep. Country Fried, this installment. Again, like you know, amazing stuff from these guys. Travis Pastrana, what can you say? He's an absolute freak. Um, you know, his vision and, and, and his skills are what takes these guys to these places and get to show us these crazy stunts that they do. and in all its glory and, and you know everything you want to see fire explosions jumps flips everything you want to see um you know people getting hurt oh that's exciting. all day long that's all they do um you know breaking that's what they bones, live for. death defying stunts so yeah again nitro circus a must see also now travis if you're watching this what <laughs> goes on in your brain when you're uh making up these concepts for people to do stunts that you don't actually do they're just brainchilds of of your vision um, he just goes and Travis. does them though. No, no, he does them. He does his backflips yeah. and does all that stuff on his, on his motorcycle. But he's also got some of the best, most extreme athletes on this planet in the show. And he just goes, guys, I got this great idea. You should do this. You should do this. Can you, he must be Travis, you are expert. one of the most influential people <laughs> on this planet. How do you do it? What goes on in your brain? I want to know. Yeah. Speaking of Travis. Another Travis. Another maniac. Out of flight. An amazing movie. Massive budget. Went to all what do you call all corners of the globe to go snowboarding with some of the best snowboarders in the world. Just a full on adventure action movie. Just the helicopter footage, the, just everything about it is just is unbelievable. Yeah, Brain Farm, especially like a massive, massive effort from those guys. They're really pioneers in that sort of cinematography and they've shown us again, backing it up from that, uh, that first film, uh, yep. That's It, That's All. They've just taken it to another level again. Unbeatable. Nailed it. Unbelievable combo, for sure. Yep, nailed it, definitely. And uh, we can get them all on garageentertainment.com.au. Uh, boys, I loved it. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. Garage has got so many movies for us to review. Let's do it. Over 7,000 hours of movie fun for you guys to watch. So definitely go check it out. I mean, these are the first three of, of many. So uh, yeah, I look forward to 
Catching up, boys? Yeah, it's been fun. Hoy show. Hoy show, mate. There you have it. Thanks, John. Thanks, Jesse. Who's John? See you next time. <laughs> Who's John? <laughs> See ya. I'm going to get on my dirt bike and wreck shit. <laughs>